You know, it used to be you would give kids lectures about stranger danger when they were outside the house. And now you have to give them the same kind of thing about strangers popping up inside their house, all because of the toys you gave them. This is, of course, a side effect of high-tech toys. The Better Business Bureau put out a warning for consumers about the possible dangers of connected smart toys. And they've got some guidelines for you, so let's take a look. First, make sure that these toys are only used over password-protected Wi-Fi, or even a VPN. Using them over public connections is an easy way to get unwanted access to those toys. You'll want to check out the toy settings and make sure there are password protections and parental controls that you can limit on who your child can and can't talk to. Do not assume that they're already the way that they should be. Those smart toys have regular updates as well, just like your phone does, so you want to keep tabs on when those updates come up. And you know, smart toys should be used in a common area in your home where you can kind of help monitor what's being said to your kid. And you need to have that stranger danger talk with your kid about the toy. You want to tell them, hey, if the toy says funny things, you need to tell mommy or daddy.